AP. She got it. Ju- I got your juicy entertainment news for Monday. Stevie J always seeming to get himself in some kind of trouble. You know, he's making headlines once again, not for his divorce from Faith Evans, but this time for being removed off a flight. Apparently, he and his son were in L.A. on Friday at the airport and were removed from their flight for not complying with Delta employees. Apparently, they were drinking alcohol in the airport terminal while they were waiting for their flight, and when boarding began, they tried to bring their booze on the plane. Delta employees asked them to throw away their drinks before boarding, but Stevie J's son decided to finish the drink before disposing of it and that kind of pissed off the Delta employees so they had Stevie J and his son thrown off the plane. Now they were able to catch another plane uh, to Atlanta to celebrate Stevie J's daughter Eva's 12th birthday party and Delta did not release the names of the persons who caused the flight's delay but they did acknowledge that there was an incident that happened Um, and Stevie J and his son were not banned from future Delta flights. However, Stevie J told, uh, he released a press statement saying, or released a statement saying that he believes the incident was racially motivated. And there's a video that's been circulating that went viral that was posted by a passenger. And Stevie J looks pretty upset while speaking with the Delta employees. And apparently he told the Delta employee he would bankrupt the airline and the employee with a massive lawsuit. The lady who posted the video said she didn't see what happened. She just kind of overheard that he had boarded the plane with open cups of liquor in his hand despite being told not to. A bunch of police showed up and then removed them from the plane. She said... I'm just trying to get home. Stevie J said he will discuss his options with his attorneys and proceed how he sees fit. Speaking of attorneys, Kim K, Kim Kardashian has passed the baby bar exam after two attempts, moving her one step closer to becoming a attorney. The real deal. Kim had previously failed the exam three times, but had COVID during one of the attempts. She actually was on social media making jokes about it. Um, The baby bar is the first of two exams needed to be taken to become an attorney in the state of California. And Kim mentioned that uh, she was told by top lawyers that this was close to impossible. This was going to be an impossible journey and harder than traditional law school, school. But it was her only option and she feels so good to be achieving her goal. She also thanked Van Jones, saying that he was the one who pushed her to go to law school. And then, of course, shouted out her father, the late Robert Kardashian, who was a hugely successful successful uh, attorney in L.A. saying that she knows her dad would be proud um, and also shocked to know that her path, his path, is now her path. Um, and she also has taken her fans along her journey, showing her late night study sessions and even showing her failures. One thing about Kim K, she definitely puts her head down to the ground and she can hustle. And that's your juicy entertainment news for Monday. Lock it in again tomorrow for more of the juice right here on the all-new KISS 96.